I got infected by the corona. Ain't that a bitch? Hello, and welcome to easy to swallow content. Content that where you can sit back and fuck your little ass. And as 2016 is aspiring back into true forming, you know what would be fucking awful and hilarious? <laughs> yeah, baby. It's time to bring it back. I'm not sure what the fuck is going on here. Frankly, I think it's disgusting. I, I, like, it feels like there's a million mole rats just spewing out of my paws. So, um, uno moment! Welcome back to the sociopathy. You know when you watch something on Watch Together and there's always like some random video that's playing on there? Well, me and my ex-wife, we went on there on one day and we saw this breakup video where it was clearly a fact where it was stretched out to reach triple ad time. <laughs> that magical little number of 10 minutes and one second. If you've seen one of these videos, you've seen them all. <laughs> We didn't, um, we didn't know how to do this at first, um, but we want to be honest to, to the, to the fans, you know, this is all about the fans because... And it's like, they are both crying in and upset because, uh, breaking up with the audience? That's what I, that's the vibe I give off, and they all, they all play out the same way. Anyway, let's dive deep into Christina K, who's sitting at 2.7 million subscribers. <laughs> Not sure who and why this bitch is, but if they were a couple channel, and, uh, she just rebranded it for herself, Good on her. I mean, <laughs> so let's watch uh, Moana's Chicken, the the YouTube channel. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. <clears throat> Look, I know I make this joke a lot, but um, are they related? That Christina and I are broken up. God may have a different plan for us in the future. Where in the Bible is uh, God's plan telling you to make a couple's YouTube channel? Because I really miss that verse. <laughs> but right now, we decided this is the best decision for both of us. You know when you get stuck in quarantine with the same bitch and you can't find an escape route, so you gotta like, tap out real quick because you're seeing every single little obsessive little thing that she's decided to crack onto you and you're too lazy to be like, whoa, bitch, you're crazy. I, um, I'm gonna go down to the bar and, and flirt with some chicks down there while you have a manic episode. You, you, you can't do that in this quarantine time of stage. So you gotta, you gotta break it off before she breaks you, basically, because on your dick and you're done for life, pal. She is not a gold digger. She's not a cheater. I'm sorry. Um, let's just rewind that part for a second. <laughs> she is not a gold digger. She's not a cheater. And why is she on YouTube? Genuine question there. Why is she on YouTube? Easiest route you could do when you're an attractive couple, right? If you're an influencer of any kind and you are attractive and you have a lot of media goals and media attention, blah, blah, blah. Clearly, this is a very good business move. <laughs> We're sitting at the monetized 10 minutes there, two and a quarter million views. Very little effort into this. Clearly, they liked each other for their uh, personality. We want to keep the specifics private. Limp dick syndrome. It's limp dick syndrome. <laughs> He's... <laughs> um, do you want to say anything else about just, you know? Just, um, if you guys could keep the comments positive. Where the fuck does she think she is? Sweetie! <laughs> is this your first YouTube video? <laughs> In one world <laughs> is a very popular YouTuber getting nothing but positive comments. The comment section is like looking at your own insecurities and subconscious yelling them at you in the back of your head. And if you read those comments and it's just like, oh wow, these guys are fucking excellent mind readers. Excellent. I want to point out that um, this was uploaded in April. Frosty the Snowman's still up there. Clearly this has been a broken house for a very long time. <laughs> I'm going to keep making videos on this channel. Yeah, she's gonna continue posting videos every Monday. <laughs> okay, right then, three minutes, they have run out of anything to say at that point. He just repeats what she says. So make sure to stick around, guys. She's gonna continue uh, fund funding me because I, I, built, I built her ground up. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, guys. She's she's gonna make some good shit. I just, I'm just curious to see what she's doing now. So, if you don't mind. I'm on her way. I'm with my sister, but she doesn't want to be seen on camera right now. 
I am in no place to say anything like this because I've got a sniper sh shot right here looking at me, but, um, Sus might be a little bit caked on a bit too much to see those those lumpy little cake, cakey little holes on top of her forehead. I mean, that's me being an asshole. I agree to that. I apologize immediately, but, um, you know, maybe, um, maybe, maybe take a sander and then smoothen down those little bumps you have on your forehead, sweetheart, or maybe, like, get a diffuser for that your sunlight that you have in your car. I'm just, I'm, 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 I'm sorry, I just, I... <laughs> So just dog shit content. Uh, I saw it coming. <laughs> it came, it conquered, and I slaughtered myself. Alright, next breakup video! Now, I don't know who these people are. They seem like they were past my time of caring about absolutely anybody. I'm not into basic bitch YouTube. Just laughing at them because they're all pathetic. I'm, she might have her own channel. I, I don't want to go that deep. I'm doing very surface level just laughing at people crying to make myself feel better. So, um, away we go! <laughs> Liza cheated on me. Ah! And there, was, there are seven Liza, guys! Steve, there are seven guys! And I found them in her bedroom! Okay. See, this is how I would do it. If, like, if I had a huge audience of 17 fucking million subscribers with 64 million views, you know, I would do it very lightheartedly. And it's under the 10 minute mark. This has got like the triple check on like everything that's doing okay at the moment. All jokes aside, um, we are broken up. Liza broke up with me six months ago. This is cheating. This is like, they said they weren't, okay, listen. <laughs> A breakup video has to happen, like, on the day. <laughs> if you're not a destroyed human being with absolutely nothing to say, so like, and you're not comfortable around that person and putting it on the internet, take those check marks off, okay? You can't do it six months afterwards. I don't care if you're crying. Then you can't do that. <laughs> it's just like, ah, uh, we've got nothing to do today. Um, uh, hey, so I, kn I know that, uh, you know, we kind of fooled around a bit, but, um, for a few months after we broke up, but, um, do you want to shoot a video? I'm kind of bored of, out of ideas of what to shoot today. How's that sound? And then she blocks you on all social media. <laughs> Next up is the infamous Jeffree Star. Now, for those of you who don't know, Jeffree Star is this very, very, very famous makeup artist, makeup brand holder, racist, sexual offender but jeffree star took uh, made a we broke up video sitting at a 32 million views with a, a 17 17 minute vid now jeffree star doesn't need any more fame than he already has he definitely doesn't need any more uh coverage or media coverage he doesn't need any more of himself out there because you know he is very out there uh <laughs> hey guys um i don't even know how to do this intro I never thought the day would come where I'd be sitting here talking about this. Um, we've tried to film this 10 times now, um, and I've cried every single time, and... Classic! <laughs> Classic! That is one of those, like, uh, a YouTube apology video things where you're like, I've tried to film this so many times, guys. Uh, you know, you got the, the YouTube sigh, everything else like that. Beautiful! I just want to point out, uh, three, four, five? five dogs okay also there's probably at least i want to say three big massive lights that is shining on this guy's bed girl at they them this bed appearing like you're in bed about to go to bed probably the funniest thing you could do especially when you got like that much of alien makeup stocked on you alien makeup it's the new alien clothing brand that we have <laughs> um there's no easy way to say this but we did break up um i've used a lot of this time of silence to... I don't know about you guys, but I can't get over the dog panting in the background. Um, I'm not into bestiality. I, I gotta point that out there. I don't like fucking dogs, but the dog breathing in this is really... Everything changes. This is just about me sharing what's really been going on, and I feel like I owe you guys an explanation, and we are just trying to heal. You know, I can't wait to get back to doing what I love and creating and Jeffree Star Cosmetics has so many amazing things to look forward to this year. This feels like when celebrities go and pretend to be like normal human beings. It's like Bill Gates trying to guess the, the price for like a, a bag of like... Totino's pizza rolls. 22. <laughs> no, no. 15. 15. People of this, like, high and mighty life 
where they, they live above everybody else and have that mentality where they're above everyone else, is that they they don't know how to be a simpleton. They don't, don't know how to be like a humble little bakery villager. Whenever shit like this goes down and they don't know how to be normal and uh, have emotions that they want to project onto people that care, there's always a, a disconnection with that. It's, it's always a beautiful little artistic piece I love to watch. I feel like I owe you all an explanation because Nathan and I have grown with each other in front of all of you and... Probably not the best wording, I'll be honest. <laughs> That's one hell of a chrome dome. It looks like the Prometheus guy got a fucking wig on. Now the internet is brutal. Jeffree Star is a really fucking radish human being and uh, to see them grow into like this this makeup brand making basic white bitches pretend like they are woke for supporting the gay person uh, even if it's a very scummy gay person yeah you just, go, just go for it you can i'll let you do your own research mm -mm, it's not easy here we have the beautiful lance stewart who you may recognize from various drama alerts from 3am calls or faking people's deaths one of those like pranking channels that everyone gets very angry about for two seconds and they move on to something else. Of course, he did a breaking up video. I really want to know the person who was really invested into Lance Stewart's life that much that they care about this person's breakup. And don't forget the puka shells on your wrist because those are important. Also, I love Gold Member over here. She's beautiful. <laughs> I love gold. Oh, this one's gonna be good. <laughs> We have Tommy Pickles over here doing the fucking fake crying face. Hang on, let me uh, let me just um, <laughs> we've been um, going through a really tough time, and um. <sighs> All right, guys. Uh... <laughs> this is another one of those uh breakup videos where it's fucking very fresh and not at all real. <laughs> we are no longer together. And the Oscar goes too. Again. Who the fuck cares? <laughs> no one is out watching your shitty content to be like, oh, I wonder what his relationship status is doing right now. No one gives a fuck. No one cares. If this is real, if you're doing like a whole bunch of shitty pranks and shit for kids, just dumb idiot people that absolutely have no capability to think for themselves other than, haha, watch his next video, me like, yes. <laughs> it isn't for absolutely no reason than ka-ching money. It is such a good marketing boy. I don't know if I want to do this. I don't really want to, but I feel like I don't want to just keep going on and I'm not. sick of filming like sad videos. <laughs> the music alone! The music alone is fucking gorgeous. Okay, hang on. I just want to see the description. <laughs> We're sorry guys, we love you and appreciate all the support. <laughs> Prank Wars! <laughs> 10.49. Yes. I want to be like fake on camera though, and I can't be happy right now. It's the broest hug I've seen any woman give. I'm gonna cry again. Babe, come on. Oh, you said babe. <laughs> that is what she looks like. <laughs> is this on a fisheye lens? Why the fuck is it like weirdly? just wide lensed. Could they not find something else better to cry on? Fucking hell. Again, this is one of those, if it is real, why? I don't even know how to start this video. Pretty sure that is makeup he has under his eyes. Unless it's like a full on rash and he's been crying for like hours. I don't, no. <laughs> it looks like the same sort of blush that she's wearing. So, you know, it's plausible, very plausible. To start with this video, like, I don't even know. So guys, like, this is not our typical type of YouTube video we'd be posting, like, at all. Like, I'm sick of filming, like, sad videos like this. Like you see, this is one of those videos where it's like, we, we, we are breaking up with you as an audience. I get, this is one of those pranking channels where the, the boyfriend pranks the girlfriend and vice versa. Yada, yada, yada. Those channels aren't meant to last on purpose. They, they live out their, their life expectancy in, like, less than two years and then they break up and then they cash in big time on that breakup and then uh you know either the person continues doing pranks or then they start doing vlogs once they reach like at a at a decent sub point where anyone will watch their shit regardless what they upload is when they will just continue to do their own bullshit we haven't can... we haven't been 100 percent honest with you guys you know wow a youtuber not honest to its audience 
Gee whiz, <laughs> never heard that one. Like the year and like you guys have been so awesome and please like only positive vibes like out there like. <laughs> Y'all, so the vibe's just like not out there, you know, like it's just like, you know, we ain't just vibing together anymore. I just, what a train wreck. Uh, absolutely no substance after the first three minutes where it's just like, we are breaking up, we're not making videos together. Stop it there. That's all you gotta say. You don't even fucking have to make a video about it. Put a tweet out. No one cares. Do it in the intro of your next video when you're pranking your fucking dying grandmother. For a first, we have a video that's under a million views. Thank the god. Whoever Piao and Fabio are, these guys look like high schoolers. This guy still has braces. And today's video is kind of hard for us to make, to make, but it's necessary because... We didn't want to film this video. Uh, it's so hard for us to say this. We just want to be open and honest with you guys. Uh, this is very hard for us to make. This is in our normal upload videos and we're sorry to let you guys know that we spent two minutes alone in the quarantine together and we hated each other because we, we couldn't stand being in each other's presence. <laughs> Where does this guy's head stop? I feel like his, his head stops here and his hair keeps going for like another foot. Is he like under six foot? So he has to make it up for, him, for himself to be like, No, I'm I'm six foot. I'm not 5'11". I, I, I promise! I'm tall! Just decided to each one take um, our way, you know, and just advance in life by ourselves because stuff wasn't working out, you know. Uh, uh, a lot of people put better, us down. A lot of people kept on saying that uh, he could do better, she could do better. She could do better, let's be fair. This guy looks like a fucking Frankenstein. I love how he's just like, um, people just keep on bullying me, so I'm, I'm leaving, bye. This, I don't want to stick around for this relationship and maybe just work on the relationship off the internet. Um, so I'm just, I'm leaving. And she's just like, you know, I probably could do better. Yep. Uh, uh. <laughs> I'm a really big fan of his t-shirt. I don't know what it is. It looks awful, right? It looks awful. But it's, I don't know, there's something about it. <laughs> it looks fun. I'm gonna end this off with a, a Jake Paul video because I feel like Jake Paul's kind of hasn't had anything thrown at him in a while. So why not? Let's talk about the breakup. Oh shit. Hell yeah, here we have Jake Paul's little victims. <laughs> you wanna start? I guess you can start. He broke my heart. This is uh, Jake Paul's audience. Just we're, we're talking. That's all it is. Oh, she broke my heart. He broke my heart. She broke my heart. We we get it. There's there's just a couple of kids that are falling in love and they don't know how to handle it. He was messaging girls. The screenshots are all over the internet. Oh, this is the weirdest fucking thing. Oh, this is weird. Oh, this is weird. Okay, that just goes on. It just goes on. Okay, okay, little Jake. I just need you to say this. I just need you to say this. Um, she cheated on me. She's a cheating whore and I hate her. Okay, can you say that? <laughs> so there we have it guys. The a totally unnecessary genre of breakup where everybody is just crying for views and attention But it's a really good marketing ploy for your channel And if you monetize it enough over 10 minutes with two seconds of content right in the beginning and then just pat it out afterwards You're fine, right? Right. <laughs> so if you're a struggling YouTuber or are struggling to stay relevant, then why not just do a breakup video? Don't be honest on the internet, unless you're wanting to watch my podcast. It's completely boring if you want something to help you fall asleep at night, that's uh, there. I'm uploading that on every Friday and uh, I don't know, I might do more of these at some point. But yeah, I got a podcast. It's just me talking out my ass for like an hour-ish. It's like what I'm doing now, but without other people's content, it does get dark and depressing half the time. So if you want to feel shit about yourself or if you want to laugh at my demise, it's a perfect place for that. Um, so yeah, um... Sorry guys, sorry that, um... We, I have to do this to you, but I'm breaking up with you. I'm ending up ending the video. Um, I... I hate to do... <laughs> I have to. <laughs> I, I have to end this video now. So I, can't, I can't do it, man. I can't fucking do. It. No, I am. I'm ending this video because I. <laughs> because people don't know how to stop making these fucking shitty breakup videos. They've been the same since 2012. Pick another fucking topic. Anyway, uh, I'll, I'm stopping that right there. Bye bye. Sayonara. Oh.